what's up everyone welcome back to a new video for today's video i am going to be reacting to the most expensive houses on sale currently in jamaica now you guys have been enjoying my living in jamaica videos cost of living in jamaica how much i spend monthly living in jamaica so today i'm going to be reacting to the most expensive houses on sale just a few disclaimers this video is just for fun i am no professional in terms of buying or selling houses strictly for fun i mean you might learn something here and there but this video is just for fun and if you are the type of person who likes to sit around admire houses then this video is for you so the site that i'm going to be using today for this video is keller williams and if you guys remember from my previous videos i actually used Coldwell Bankers and Century 21. Today I'm going to be using Keller Williams. And the reason why is that I find that Keller Williams has a lot more houses in the type of value that we're looking for. So I'm going to be using them today and we're going to see what they have. So let's go ahead. So I'm going to go ahead and just search Keller Williams, Jamaica, and we're going to bring up. So of course, we're going to filter our search so we're going to look in for stuff on sale and of course residential property type is a house and we're not going to put in any location this time because we're looking all across jamaica for the houses on sale so we're not putting in kingston and st andrew we're looking all across jamaica today and we're going to change the currency to jamaican dollars just because we're in jamaica and we're mostly negotiating jamaican dollars in jamaica price range now this is going to be the first time in our lives that we will filter from high to low and it's just for the sake of this video so we're going to filter the highest value that they have here which is a hundred million dollars so we're going to filter by that and we're going to search and see what they have so these are the properties and the first one is four hundred and sixty seven million a hundred and four thousand dollars this is five bedrooms five bathrooms so we're going to look at it and this is for sale let's see where this is located this is in Kingston and St Andrew and we are going to see so let's go down to the description so this is in Jacksonville I mean all right so let's look on the inside this is the kitchen and i really like this modern look and the wooden decor i really like it it gives it a nice vibe and they have ceramic tiles so this is i guess is the dining room and it's a little bit i mean some of the stuff are a little bit you can see that they are a little bit ancient but let's go on and see this is like a little I guess like a playroom or like a game room maybe you could make this like a game room it looks like a game room to me and uh, I mean the bedroom the bedroom looks a bit small definitely but I mean we could make it work we could make it work let's see if this work all right so the bathroom I like the bathroom it's modern and you have the his and her sinks like i really like that about the bathroom and it's spacious so we're going to give them a plus for that let's go so this is the i guess this is the other this is a, like a different angle of the bedroom and a different angle of the bathroom oh this is a separate bathroom we would like a yeah this is a separate bathroom and this one this one is nice i mean i guess this one is nice also this is another bedroom which looks small as well but we can make it work i mean this is another bathroom oh i guess this is like so it's like one bathroom but they separated it so if one person wants to use one side the other person wants to use the other side then so i really like that idea so that's a plus also the next bedroom, I guess this could be like for the kids or like the nursery room because I mean, 
this would definitely be like a nursery room for me it looks a bit too small to be like an adult's bedroom so this was like a nursery room and this is another bathroom this is really nice i mean the bathrooms are not bad they are not bad the decor is so modern i really like the bathrooms and this is like the living area which is not bad very spacious very modern and i really like the way how high the ceiling is that when you're in a house and the ceiling is so high you feel rich you feel rich i really like how high the ceiling is and i really like the chandelier it's not too bad it's not too much it's it's perfect so i really like that about the chandelier and this is i guess this is like another living area maybe like a patio and i really like it so and this is like the swim pool area i guess you could play games out here as well and just chill have some drinks maybe have brunch this is a nice chill area and um, that's like another angle they have a swimming pool i really like the fencing the fencing is just so nice and of course it's two stories so overall this is not bad and tell me if you think it's worth it i don't think it's worth it but let's move on let's look at the next house all right let's look at this one this is 306 million five hundred and thirty seven thousand dollars and this looks like a castle this is also this is four bedrooms four bathrooms this looks like a castle like a very asian castle but lie i'm not going to lie i really like the exterior it's it's a nice vibe that asian vibe i really like it and then it's kind of on this little hill by itself which is i mean you can't be mad about that that's a vibe let's see if we can get some pics of the inside the inside now really need a lot of redecorating like, there's too much happening right there right now too much like i don't even know what the hell i should be looking at there's too much happening right there definitely needs to be redecorated i guess this is like a bathroom but the angles are not really giving much justice this is like a dining area and this is giving me like 1990s vibe 90s or the 80s vibe these are really ancient the kitchen no the kitchen looks a little bit modern i mean <laughs> i really don't know how to feel about the kitchen like there's a mix of modern and ancient happening in the kitchen and i can't really figure out how i feel about it but the fridge is nice the cupboards uh i don't know let's move on and this is the closet this is the bedroom a lot of these are ancient do you guys know those old mafia movies i'm getting that vibe from from this house 80s 90s movies that's the vibe i'm getting from this house oh hold on there okay so i mean and you get a nice view you're on the hillside you can look down into the city so that's nice this is another bedroom i like this bedroom it doesn't really look spacious but i like it i really do another view of the city and this is just the outside another bathrooms like this bathroom does look modern but Like the whole, the outside is not bad. It's not bad. Three hundred and six million dollars. I mean, what exactly are we paying for? Like persons who are experts in selling houses, what exactly are we paying for? I'm guessing that you probably get it with the furniture. So that is why it's so pricey. And then the location, and then the number of bathrooms. So it was four bathrooms, four bedrooms. So I guess that would kind of hike up the price a bit, but I don't, don't feel like a lot of these are worth the money. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm too broke to understand. Help me out. But 
$291,940,000. This is six bedrooms and seven bathrooms. Why do we have more bathrooms than bedrooms? I guess when you're rich, you can sleep in your bathroom. I mean, we're poor, we don't understand. But this is an, this has, oh, I really like this. I really like this. This is in Jamaica. I really like this. I really like the exterior. It looks mother. Oh, so let's go. This is a kitchen. The kitchen looks so nice. That's at the dining. That's at the dining area. That dining table is so nice. And I really love how like the wallpaper at the back kind of just matches the whole furniture and the paint and the chandelier. This screen's rich. So rich. And this is like another chill area, I guess. Ooh. And that's like a crocodile on. Is that a crocodile on the table? This is nice. This is nice. Leather seats. Oh, they have their own. It's like a salon chair. So you have your own salon area. I like that. This is one of the bathrooms. I really like the tile of the bathroom. I really like the tile of the house. This is giving me like subtle modern contemporary vibe and of course there's a gym there's a gym come this is that what well, this is a bedroom this is worth it this worth it this worth it this is what 291 million 940 thousand another bedroom worth it a hundred percent a hundred percent this is the garage pool it's worth it i can't stress how much i am in love with this place like if anybody out there anybody out there who is looking and wants to buy me this place like taker any taker is like please let me know if you're willing to buy me this place because this is like this is it. This is the dream house. This looks good. Let us go down. So, this is in Norbrook. And if you guys don't know, Norbrook is like one of those, what we call uptown communities in Jamaica. And, I mean, ceramic tile. This. This. This is worth it. This one is worth it. I cannot lie. Let's look at one more property. One more and see what else we have. Let us go. Let us look at this one. Five bedrooms, six bathrooms. This one is $255,447,000. So let's pull it up. Let's see what this looks like. I love the exterior. It's like those rich kids in high school movies. This is what they own. I really, 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 really love this. I really love this. This is like a hotel lobby area. Hotel lobby. Okay. And then this dining area, everything. I love this. I really like this. I can't tell if this is a bedroom or a spa area. It's possibly a bedroom, but it looks like a spa area. I will turn it into a spa area because when you're rich, you can do whatever you want with and however you want to do it. So I'll turn it into a spa area. The room gives me spa vibe, massage vibe. But I'm guessing that this is a bedroom. Let's move on. And then this is like another living area. Very spacious. I mean, it needs a little bit of, you know, but we can work. This is like the bathroom. I mean, the bathroom is not bad. It's not bad. We can make it work. 
on the ceiling. All right, let us. And this is, oh, is this, I will turn this into like my makeup area, like the vanity mirrors and everything. This is a vibe. This would be my makeup area. Definitely like so nice. And what is, is this a mother? This is a closet? This is a closet. Bro. Can I just have this closet, please? This is a closet. This is so nice. I mean, it looks manly. It looks manly. Definitely looks manly. But I could switch this around and make it a bit more feminine. But this is a big ass closet. Like, oh my gosh. Another bathroom. Love the decor. It's subtle. It's nice. It's vibrant. I love it. And the outside. The outside is so spacious. And I love the pavement. Like yes i need pavement the pool i mean they can chill under a mango tree a mango tree that a mango tree i think that's a mango tree another bedroom Like, where are the doors for the bedrooms? Oh, the bedrooms are so open. Where are the doors? I need my door shut. This is another bathroom. Ooh, the kitchen, this kitchen. Hello. This screams, you can't afford this. You cannot, like, this kitchen screams rich in several languages. This kitchen, I love this kitchen. Hello, I'm obsessed. Listen, this is, this is maybe like a powder room. I don't know. Yeah, it definitely like, looks like a powder room. That looks like a powder room. And then what is this? I guess it's just I guess what is this? Is this like a bar? This is a bar. This is like a bar, okay? Oh my gosh. And this is another bathroom. Another bedroom. Another bathroom, another bedroom, another bathroom, another bedroom. Like when you're rich bathrooms are unlimited bedrooms are unlimited okay it's unlimited i love it but this one a garden area vibe hello vibe a vibe i love this i love this outside is so nice bro this is two hundred and fifty-five million four hundred and forty-seven thousand five hundred dollars. This is worth it, my darlings. This is worth it. Wow. I mean, I mean, security system, ceiling fans, garden area, swimming pool, fully fenced. Standby generator, cable, main level entry, hurricane shutters, fully walled, kitchen built in, water heater, additional accommodation. It's giving me all sorts of vibes. So, and that is it for today's video, you guys. I do hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. And tell me what you think. Do you think these houses is worth the millions or they are reaching with these prices? Let me know in the comment section. And if you want to see more of these videos, feel free to comment what videos I should do next. And I'll do my best in creating those videos for you guys. 
thank you guys for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next one bye